As shown here, there are three opened windows. At the active program window, click the title bar, hold it and shake to minimize the other open windows. To bring back the minimized windows, click, hold and shake again the title bar of the active window. In your desktop window, to hide or minimize open windows, you may click the small area at the lower right corner beside the notification area. To bring back the open windows, click the same area again. Double click the title bar of the window to maximize or restore it. Press and hold the title bar of the window to move it to your desired location on your screen. It is useful when you have another monitor connected to your computer. Usually, when you want to close the window, you make use of the left button of your mouse and click the X. But, you may also close the tab or window using your mouse scroll wheel. Instead of selecting or highlighting a word by dragging the mouse pointer, you may double-click the word to select it or triple-click to select the whole sentence or paragraph. To adjust the column according to the width of the text, position your mouse pointer in between the two columns and double click it. This also applies in adjusting automatically the row height to show the whole text. In Excel, automatic numbering could be done using the mouse as shown. Autofill could be done also for days of the week and for months. This trick also could be used to copy the text to its adjacent cells in either row or column.
To select the entire column, you may click the column header, while in rows, you click the row number. But another trick to select the whole worksheet is by clicking the Select All button located at the upper left corner beside the first column and first row. To jump down to the last cell in the continuous set of data, move your mouse pointer to the bottom line of the cell until the cursor pointer changes then double click. To return, Move your mouse to the upper line of the cell, then double click. To jump to the rightmost cell of the table, move your mouse pointer to the right line of the cell, then double click it. To return, move your mouse to the left line of the cell, then double click.